What's up, YouTube? It's me, Amnix 2005 and today I got a response to a comment that I received on my how to install um, a Mac theme on Windows 7. So, the the theme or the comment was, "How do I change my taskbar to look like Mac?" Um, and basically, uh, this this guy this guy is a pretty cool guy. His name is I Techno Dylan. Um, check out his channel; it's gonna be in the description. Um, go ahead and check him out, but he says that he tried it and it didn't look good at the end So I'm gonna show you guys how to do it so everybody can understand as well as him So basically, um, you're gonna want to go ahead and download the Mac OS X finder. It's gonna be located here um, Just click download file right up in the right hand corner now before I continue on with this tutorial I'd like to say I got a new dock right here. It is called RK launcher um, I love it. It's a really good really really good dock you can add icons to here they look HD um, and it's just it's definitely um by far really good um really really good uh, dock that I've gone in. I like it better than rocket dock if you don't want to download it um go ahead and download it from this website the CNET or download.cnet um their website Windows Edge for it's the people that made the RK launcher it's currently down I keep on clicking the links and they're dead so I did went ahead and show you guys this one um, this is a straight up link. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and get into the tutorial. Um, you want to go ahead and download that installer and finder bar, like I just said, and it's going to come up with a folder like this. All you're going to do is when you open it up, you're going to see this other little file, application file, it's going to be called install finder bar 1.5, and you just drag it to your desktop, or you can just run it. Um, so all you're going to do is run it, and let's see, run it like this, and then click install. So I've already installed it. Obviously, once you install it, it might Windows Seven might say that you installed it wrong. Just click OK. It doesn't matter. As you see, mine doesn't. That folder doesn't really have anything. Um, so yeah, it's gonna say that. Just click. Oh, uh, you installed it correctly. Then click the um, the Windows button right here, and you're gonna search Finder Bar. Now, before you do click this Finder Bar Engine button to get it to start, you're gonna want to make sure you change the properties up here. You're gonna click Properties. You're going to click use small icons, never combine. Make sure you have those on because if you don't, it's going to look all big and distorted. It's not going to look good. You want to make sure never combines on as well as use small icons. So once you've done that, you're going to run find a bar and it's going to start up. It's going to, it might go to the min, the taskbar here. You can go ahead and X this out. So there you go. It's started up. Um, and as you see, it's a simple finder bar just like a Mac. Um, you can click preferences, and it's going to bring up these preferences for it. Um, and there's a. Uh, nope. And uh, you can just. You, you can do a lot on this. It's, it's a great program. Now, a lot of people were telling me um, the only problem is you have this big Windows thing up here. Hold on, let me just. So you guys can see this better. Um, they say that you can. They don't like this Windows thing, so you can change this. I'm, there is a way to change it. What you're gonna do? I'm, I'm not gonna show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys how to, but I'm not gonna actually do it myself because I really don't. I don't want to go through. It's a little complicated. It's not too complicated, but I just don't feel like doing it. But I will bring in the link, and this link has everything. So here's the link. It literally gives you a step by step on how to do it. It's a program called Windows 7 um, Start Button Changer Version 1.0. And literally, it's a step by step by step on how to do it. Okay? Um, so it's really not that hard. You just go to this website. You're going to go down to the bottom. If you want to download it, you're going to see, don't click this. this is, you're going to download Facemoots, and that's like virus shit. But you're going to see right here, it's this little download. So you're going to click it. Okay? And it's going to download it for you. And then um, you can just read through the instructions on how to do it. It's pretty simple. It'll change it. You can, if you want to get more, um, like, uh, what's it called? More, uh, what am I trying to say? More orbs, which that's what they're called, orbs. You can go to, let's see, where is it? There's a website. Well, I think it's Devi Deviant Art is the website. But I'll, I'll, I'll provide in the link in the description. It's for more orbs. Um, and it, you can find the Mac orb there as well. So you can change this to a Mac, like a Mac, a Mac version or an Apple logo. So yep, that's it. Um, thanks for watching. It's me, Adam2005. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And um, I hopefully, um, I want you guys to ask questions and uh, request tutorials and things like that because I do. Um, um, maybe iTech, uh, 
I Techno Dylan. He'll he'll tell you. I do respond right away. Um, I don't wait. I don't. I, I try to make it right on time for you, for you guys. I don't mind making tutorials. I don't mind doing all this. As long as you guys watch my videos, you guys rate them. Remember, you know, you see that like button? Go ahead and click it, please, because I need that. Um, it doesn't. It literally only takes like one second to do it. So, thanks for watching. It's me, Adam2005. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And this was how to get the find the bar.